Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a really quick tutorial. It's like a, a five minute thing on this messy bun. The messy bun has an art to it and I'm sure you know about it. It's kind of hard to do and I've tried many different ways like truly everything that's out there available in this way is the way that I feel like I mastered the art of messy buns and I'm about to teach you it's easy breezy you're gonna have the greatest time and you're gonna have a messy bun just like this one so if you do enjoy this look stick around and watch the rest of this tutorial with me Okay guys, so let's get this started. My hair is a mess as you can see and look at my bangs. When people are asking, why don't you wear your bangs? This is why, because it, they are crazy. <laughs> Couple things you might want to keep in mind is to have a dry shampoo handy as well as a teasing brush. And those are for the girls who do not have a lot of volume or lift to the roots of the hair. This will help the look of the messy bun to be like a little more poofy, you know, out here. And I'll show you what I'm talking about when we get to it. Um, so if you do want to take the time to do the dry shampoo, I already did a little bit on mine, um, not on camera. And um, if you want to tease yours, I do advise you to do so because it will really help your messy bun to look really messy and pretty buffy. So here's the thing. Now I already spray some stuff. You want your hair to be messy if you want to spray texturizing uh sprays on your hair and just kind of like play with it like this that'll be fine too the messy bun thing though is like if you start with messy hair it will really help um the look of it to look like really messy and not like really ballerina like so that's kind of like what you have to do a little bit see just kind of like lion king here yeah so first things first you do want when you're pulling up your hair you want to pull it loosely so just keep that in mind don't pull it from here up like this just go kind of like gently and loosely and then you put it in the into the shape that you want to pay no attention to my bangs we're gonna put them back or pin them back later but you want to make sure that all the hairs are picked up and then you want to bring them up all the way up here to the top of your head. And mind you, I've done this many times, the messy bun, in, in different ways. And it just never seems to work um, really well unless I'm like doing this kind. So what you're going to do, it, you're going to kind of open that. And leave this center here I just want to make sure you're seeing and then you're going to grab this hair here like so you're gonna want to get a hair um, elastic if you want to do a third Tie, that's fine I just did two because I want mine a little bit loose and then you just pull it like this so you're gonna pretty much have all of this hair left over and you want to kind of spread them out evenly here because we are getting ready to roll it up so basically this is what you're gonna have okay okay so what you're gonna want to do when they are all spread evenly is to just twist it up and roll it in the elastic so you're going to be hiding that elastic like that and then if there's anything left you can keep on rolling too See if there's like a point like this, just roll it in, just keep on rolling. And then this is basically what you're going to be left with. You can, 
you can put your fingers through your roots and kind of pull it up a bit. That's the beauty of having the elastic not so tight because then you can do that easily. For anything that's kind of like wild or like lost in here, you just pull it gently and, and use a bobby pin to fix it. But this is like a super cute messy bun look. And then if you do have the bangs, le bangs is a problem here. You can do like a little, a cute little style with them to the side if that's your taste, you know what I mean? I honestly think the beauty of the um, messy bun is to actually have messy hair. So to me, it, it's kind of weird to have like a cute little bang you know with with this style so i like it better when i pull mine back like this and then if i feel like i need more than a couple things i will just um just keep on pulling it and and putting bobby pins as much as you want to and you know for things like you know this guy here is on the loose I, I'm not even going to try to fix it. Just leave it because it's like, you know, it goes with the look like being this. If you need to pin back here, I would just because my hair always wants to fall. But that's it. This is like the cutest hairstyle. I've been wearing this almost every day. It's like so easy to go once you kind of master it. I just feel like that's all I want to wear every day. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, little tutorial and if you did so do not forget to leave me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time. Um beijo! Tchau, tchau!